My dear friends in Christ Jesus, I welcome every one of you to the third day of the Novena of the Miraculous Medal. Let us believe and trust that through the intercession of the Mother Mary, the Lord is continually showering His blessings upon us. Today, we are going to reflect about the life of St. John Maria Vianney, who had a great devotion to the Miraculous Medal. St. John Mary Vianney, the patron of all priests, had great devotion to Mary. He was a devotee of the Immaculate Heart of Mary and of the Miraculous Medal. On 1st May 1836, the cure of Ars did something very beautiful and it was very valuable for his people. That is, he consecrated the entire parish and all the parishioners to the Blessed Virgin. He had a votive heart made to hang around the neck of the statue of Blessed Mother in the church. Then he took a long ribbon and with his own hand inscribed the names of all his parishioners on it. And then he placed it inside the votive heart. On it he had engraved these words. Consecration of the parish of ours to Mary conceived without sin. Made the 1st of May 1836 by John Maria Vianney. This was his way of making sure that his parish and his people were always under the patronage and the protection of the Blessed Virgin Mary and always kept in her maternal heart. The inscription O Mary conceived without sin is taken as it is from the writings on the Miraculous Medal. With so much devotion to the Miraculous Medal, he made the tabernacle of the parish of Ars. Therefore, we see that John Mary Vianney had a great devotion to Blessed Mother and the Miraculous Medal. Therefore, today let us ask the grace of God through the intercession of John Maria Vianney that we will always unite ourselves into the hands of Mary and offer ourselves to God. O Mary, conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you.